friends welcome back to our channel agrim it education in our last video we talk about joining but some of our viewers want to know about basic storage actually before joining you should know what is the storage and what are the types of storage so for that we are sharing this video i hope you will enjoy this video so in this video we are covering what is the storage what are the types of storage difference between san and nas and object based storage so what is the storage uh, in common language you can say that uh, storage is the uh, device where we can save our data that is called storage what are the types of storage dash nas san and object based storage here you can see what is the dash nas and san dash is direct attach storage from name you can understand direct attach storage means uh, it is directly attached to the server so it is block level storage it is belong to one server or system only so it cannot be shared uh, so if server goes down and obviously storage also can be down so nas what is the nas nas is network attached storage it is uh, work on ethernet so in that uh, storage uh, file system is created on storage level only uh and it is shared uh, over the network uh, through nfs and cifs protocol uh, so it is shared as a drive file or directory uh, it is share uh, as well uh, client as well as uh, server also the third one is san san is storage area network it is uh, it is a block level storage so it is work on fc network so from a storage side block disk will be provided to server and uh, from server level it will be format and fi uh, file system created on server level so it can be connect through uh, on server only through uh, fc fc switches i created one paint document Uh, you can understand better from here so what is the dash dash is directly attached to storage uh, server uh, storage is directly attached to server and from client it is uh, access through network so if this server goes down then storage obviously it will be uh, down so what is the nas nas uh, in nas storage is connected with network switch and server also connected with network switch and client also connected with network switch so here on storage level file system is created and uh, and it will be share as a nfs or cifs through on uh, server as well as client so third one is san san is connect uh, san in san storage is connected on fc switches fc switches is san switches and server also connected with san switches and client is connected through lan switches client it is connected through lan switches so from a storage side uh, raw disk block disk will be provided to server and from server level it will be format and file system will be created and it can be accessed through uh, client uh, from network so here in next example also you can understand dash nas and san so what is the dash dash is a direct attached storage it is directly attached to the server and once uh, one storage can be connect on one server only so that is network switches uh, network uh, sorry nas diagram so storage and uh, servers are connected with storage server and all clients are connected with network switch and uh, storage will be shared across the network that is sand diagram 
so storage is connected with SAN switches and server also connected with SAN switches and client can access data through network so what is the difference between SAN and NAS so access mode uh, NAS file can be accessed uh, through NAS and uh, SAN uh, it is block level storage so block can be accessed so access medium SAN is work on Ethernet and sorry NAS is work on Ethernet and SAN is work on fiber channel protocol NAS is work on TCP IP protocol and SAN is work on FC or SCSI, SCSI protocol so NAS efficiency will be less and the SAN obviously it will be more because it is work on FC so client in NAS uh, NAS client will be server as well as workstation so SAN client will be server only so basic difference is in NAS uh, file system already created on a storage level and in SAN it is block storage so file system can be created on uh, server level client level here also you can understand the protocol uh, in NAS NFS and CIFS protocol will be used NFS for Linux and CIFS for Windows so now what is the object based storage object based storage basically used in cloud environment so it, it will work on object ID like if you if you see in Facebook when you save your images so it will go to uh, object it will go into object storage so example of object storage is like uh, AWS AWS S3 and uh, Google Drive also you can say as a object storage it will work on HTTP protocol so here also you can better understand so this one is a block and file system already on cre created on top of it so it is a NAS so this is a simple block so it is a SAN storage and third one is object storage it is uh, so many objects are there like uh, video photos images all these things so that's it for today I hope you enjoy this video if you enjoy then please like this video and don't forget to subscribe uh, for watching more videos if you have any query then you can you can comment on YouTube as well as you can mail us uh, our mail ID is agreemity education at gmail.com we have a Facebook page also you can like our Facebook page and and if you want uh, online training then you can mail us we will uh, revert back you okay thank thanks for watching see you next time goodbye